Martin Kim, how you doing? So we're really glad to have you here. Thanks for coming today. So now, Harry, before we got to talk to you, we were just uh, boning up on how to do the Dougie. You have instructional <laughs> video online. Yes, are you doing it? Are you doing it right now? Well, not right now, but as soon as we're done. <laughs> <laughs> so now, Harry, tell us about this n- new show. Called, it's a, uh, I'm, I'm not quite it's sure. I was... It's called Fake Off, and basically people always ask, what is Fake Off? Yeah. You know, there's so many things that come into the element, but the first, what a fake is, is an illusion. And these teams, uh, they come from different backgrounds, whether it be miming, whether it be acrobatics, dance, uh, um, shadow puppetry, and they're, they're given a theme and they have to recreate it in their unique way, and which it equals to these amazing, crazy performances uh, that you'll see on Fake Off. Right. I, we were watching a little video on it. Yeah. It does look really wild, but where's the faking part come, or am I missing something? Uh, the faking is illusion. So when you see an illusion and if they fake you out, that's a fake. You know, it's, it's kind of like, uh, you know, the way they <laughs> you would use, you know, faking is, is very different. Like, oh, you're faking something. Uh, but this way, it's, it's in a way, it's a good way. Like, oh, you faked us out. Okay. And uh, that's where that, that comes from. Okay. Yeah, you know, I saw something on America's Got Talent this summer where a kid or a group of kids did a similar thing, and I wondered if it came from that because it was it was really astounding. Yeah, you know, I think it's a, it's an old art form that has been around for you know many many years, and you know other shows have have been have been uh, showcasing it as well, and uh, we wanted to have a find a home that where you can really come in and go to town you know there's no singing involved it's really the art of movement mm-hmm. and the art of faking yeah and the wow. t- and the teams don't know what the uh, the theme is going to be you give it to them on the spot no no they're they're, they're known by like a week week ahead okay mm-hmm. uh, and and they're able to because there's so many factors outside of choreographing and they have costuming they have staging right. have props and the background if you see like really elaborate video projections on the back so that takes some time as well um, Harry, I want to know about Glee. You are just a huge star on Glee, and you're so handsome and wonderful. How did you get that part? Oh, you're so sweet. Uh, well, I, I just same thing as, as an actor going in. I auditioned for for the part, and I actually I auditioned uh, as coming in as a just a you know backup dancer, mm-hmm. and you know the 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 role grew over time uh, or throughout the years. And it's just been a, such a blessing to be part of it. Uh, I see that you at uh, one time worked as a dancer with Mariah Carey. Do you, do you think you know yeah. what I'm going to ask you about? <laughs> I have no clue, but uh, well, go ahead. I, I'm just curious Aww. about the other night at Rockefeller Center. Mm-hmm. You know, they released the vocal track of her performance there, and it was uh, it was a little pitchy. Let's let's leave it at that. Did you see it? I haven't seen it, but I mean, I, I'll say this. I think. I think she deserves to to do whatever she wants now because she's been so on point over the over the years. Mm-hmm. Yeah, was she difficult when you worked with her? Was she diva ish like they're saying? No, I had a great experience working with her. I, I we we I think we did like a I think it was a NFC uh, Thanksgiving performance was the last thing I did with her, mm-hmm. and she was great. I mean, I, sometimes you know, as back in dance too, you don't get that much interaction with artists, right? Uh, and, and she's. She was really sweet and a pleasure to work with. Now, I think more interesting, you worked with Jennifer Lopez. Now, did you date her, too? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> well, she loves the younger guys, and, and Harry is so cute. <laughs> I wasn't the lucky. I wasn't a oh. lucky one. I I, uh, I I just performed with her. Uh, <laughs> but uh, another one, just uh, hard work and so sweet. Well, this, uh, this new show called Fake Off on True TV, I, I mean, visually, it is amazing. Yeah. And I think you might have a hit on your hands. I'm ho- I hope so. I hope more people watch. And, 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 you know, when you hear the word fake off, you're like, what is this? So I think with that, you just have to turn on the TV and check it out. All right, Harry. Harry Shum Jr. Uh, from Glee. You know him from Glee. But uh, once again, check out the new show on True TV called Fake Off on Monday nights. And uh, nice talking to you, Harry. You too. And record yourself doing the Dougie, huh? <laughs> oh, we will. Yeah, we'll send it. We'll send it right out to you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks, Harry. Thank, Thank you. you. Yep, Bye. Bye.